Hello everyone and welcome back to Deals Health and Beauty. Recently, news came out about people getting hookworm infections from beaches. So today, we are going to talk about some of the different diseases that are spreading at beaches. Parasites that are found in beaches that cause illness for human beings and which are in the water and in the sand. Says. You can actually get this from swimming pools as well because it is caused when little nippers or babies and young children are allowed in the water and they go to the bathroom in it. You also get this from eating raw oysters or undercooked oysters. Neurovirus. Dogs can also get this, so observe your pet closely after a trip to the beach. Neurovirus is quite hard to kill and it can be lethal because many people die from it every year. Vibrio vinificus. E. coli Intestinal diseases Spiridium Diseases, illnesses caused by hookworm infections. Giardia. Many people are familiar with this, but what you might not know is that dogs can actually get this. So, once again, make sure that you observe your pack closely after a trip to the beach. Staff, or also known as MRSA. <laughs> Many people are also familiar with this, and it is quite common, unfortunately.
diseases caused by roundworms such as Ascariasis and Trichinosis. Hepatitis. Ludinella Many of you may have heard of this, but basically avoid touching any snails you find on the beach because they cause swimmers itch. Swimmers ear. Oh my, we have the itch and the ear. We are covering all of our swimmers basics today. Leptospirosis. Dogs can also get this. Oh dear. I've said this like three different times. I'm getting awfully repetitive, but it's alright. But I'm going to say it again. Be sure to observe any changes in your dog's behaviour after a trip to the beach. Pink eye. I think we're all familiar with this one. Campylobacteriosis. Ah, oh, that is a big word. Eye problems or corneal infections. Enterovirus. 